What's up everybody and welcome back to Ducks and Download. So in this quick video, I just wanted to go over one of the biggest problems I think I have with Hasbro and the Black Series. No, it's not that my wallet's not big enough, which trust me, I think that's all of our problems. To me, it's this weird anchor that Hasbro and the Black Series seem to have currently had just hooked line and sinker into TV and movies only. I know they have a comic line, but even through the comic line of releases, we're still just getting Luke Skywalker's Leia. Uh, Mara Jade is so far the closest thing I can think of to what I'm about to say, but more or less, get away from all the movies and all the TV shows. There are comics. There are expanded universe figures that we collectors are absolutely dying to have. Release a line of Yu Zong Vong. Release the legacy of the Sith. Darth Talon. You... You seriously don't think Darth Talon wouldn't sell off the shelves in seconds? If nothing else, people would just reuse the Talons as a harem of Tweelings for their Sith Lords. You're gonna sell a lot of Darth Talons. Darth Krayt and his amazing armor. Like, there are so many amazing potential characters from the EU that they're just not touching for some reason. One of my absolute favorite figures that I've picked up recently is my expanded universe Luke Skywalker. This Luke Skywalker is from when he turned to the dark side and joined Emperor Palpatine. How amazing would that be to have a six inch version of the Dark Empire storyline? Young Palpatine, Sith Luke, Jedi Leia, so many amazing things that are still easily selling to this day in the 3.75 counterpart. That's the part that confuses me the most because when I go to vintage toy stores and you look around, you're going to see everywhere. Back in the power of the Force days, Kidder had no problem shoveling absolute glub shittos into packaging. And that's what we want. Where's the mole dude from the Kenobi series? People would buy that figure. So even when it comes to television and movies, you guys are still only remaking Obi-Wan. Like, I love the Inquisitors, but you remade two Obi-Wans. And then you released Lola with Obi-Wan and didn't even give us a small Leia. I'm so confused. I think the biggest bone that has been thrown to us is definitely Bastila and Malak coming to the Black Series lineup, but that's not enough. There are so many figures, Cade Skywalker, so many amazing EU characters that you could reuse a lot of sculpts for. Just take parts of Leia and Mary Jade and boom, you have every Leia and Han child that is a female. Boom, we got a little bit of Luke Skywalker, we threw on the hairstyle from Han Solo. Oh hey look, it's Ben Skywalker. And uh, things like that. There are boundless opportunities, but at the same time, I probably shouldn't have too much of bated breath to wait on this because we still haven't gotten a super battle droid. I still have not seen a Genosian soldier. I mean, where's Master Luminara? There are so many strange things that the Black Series has just haven't touched on. And I would definitely say that the three and a quarter inch figures have always just outdone the six inch when it comes to variety. Now, of course, they've been around for far longer, but I mean, there's even Ralph McQuarrie three and a quarter figure styles. We have pops of Ralph McQuarrie concept art. To me, the biggest upgrade that we're getting to the actual line itself was Chrysanta being re-released. That was the first, okay, yeah, we've kind of messed up. Let's retry this. And they're gonna probably make it, what, 35, 40 bucks? And yeah, I really want a Chrysanta. I really do. And I was really wanting that first one to be good. It was not. So we need more comic line. Keep the comic line up, but, but get away from the normal characters. Let's really dive into these comics and pull out some amazing people that have just been dying to have figures made of them again. And let alone Old Republic, there's the High Republic. You guys are literally selling books that are filled with characters and people are buying these books, cosplaying the characters, writing about the characters, falling in love with the characters, and you've not even thought of one figure yet. No pipe unreveal, nothing. I will honestly be shocked if it's not 2025 before we see our first High Republic figure. I will be shocked. So write this down in the comments. Make sure you hold me accountable in 2025. If before then we have a High Republic figure, I will be so surprised. All right, guys. Well, thank you so much for listening to me rant about how the Black Series just needs to step up in some cases. But let me know what you think. What do you think Hasbro and the Black Series should really do next? Put it down in the comments below. I love hearing y'all's opinions. Thank you so much for joining me. And as always, may the force serve you well.